people keep talking about skills and skills and skills. And one of the things that I know that research has showed is that uh, graduates of higher education or even school graduates lack uh, very basic uh, skills, soft skills. So things like communication, things like flexibility, things like leadership. When we do group work, usually in a group you need to have a leader who's going to make sure that people are finishing on time, that the, the rest of your colleagues are doing the, the job and they are on task, they are not digressing, that it is uh, of a certain quality that the teacher will, will accept. So to me that's, a, uh, and, and actually getting people to work together, that could be a mark of a leader. It's something that could happen as, in, even in primary uh, schools. In Egypt and in the rest of the Arab world, you would hear that, oh yes, we teach through the medium of English, or English is the medium of instruction. But when you actually go inside the classroom, it will be a bit of Franco-Arab, so it's a bit of English, a bit of Arabic. Is that what we want when we say English is a medium of instruction? I don't think so.